Hi, this is Kim Whittemore. I'm going to share with you my favorite six keyboard shortcuts that I use most often in Photoshop. These really help me to work fast when I'm doing a composite or any other kind of image. Okay, the first one is the letter F. By pressing the letter F, that puts me in full screen mode. The advantage of that is I can move anywhere I want. So my second keyboard shortcut is pressing the space bar and that changes my cursor into a hand tool and that allows me to move my image wherever I want. And that's real handy when you have lots of little windows and different things going on on your screen and you need to uh, move this where it's more convenient. Third is the zoom tool. The easiest way to get to that is by pressing Command and your spacebar at the same time and then taking your mouse or your pen tool and going left and right. And that will allow you to zoom in and out real easily. Okay. Next up, I'd like to work on this mask. So let's say I want to knock out this black. Okay, I got my mask selected over here, but I have the wrong color here. So by pressing X, that changes the foreground color. So we'll keep it on black, that's where I want it, okay? Next, I need to, I need to brush some of that away, but my brush is way too big. The easiest way to adjust my brush size is to press Control and Option, or Alt, on the keyboard at the same time, and then again, left and right with the mouse or the pen tool. And that will increase or decrease. And also, if you go up and down, you can adjust the hardness of your brush if you want it real hard or if you want it real soft. Okay, so let's get down a little softer. Let's zoom in just a little bit. Okay, so I am knocking out. I'll just go sloppily here for demonstrating purposes. Okay, there we go. Now, to get to this, for me, painting at this angle is kind of awkward. By pressing R, I get to the rotate tool and I can rotate my image around and press B to get back to the brush tool, and there we go. That was a lot more uh, intuitive. Okay, hit R, we'll go back. And by pressing the Shift key while you're doing that, you kind of lock it into these um, different angles. Okay. Well, there we go. My quick six, my favorite shortcuts in Photoshop. I hope you were able to learn something from that, and happy Photoshopping.